Hey everyone, this is Bo doing another Bible review. And uh, this is the uh, second Bible that I had uh, rebound by Francisco Guerrero. And it is great as well. You know, uh, Francisco is such a professional. He, he did such a good job with this. Um, this is, I have it all done more like a clean... Uh, old worldly look it's in uh, cowhide and uh, and the covers cowhide and the liners uh, the same cowhide so it really just looks really good it feels so good it's a uh, really uh, thick yet uh, I say spongy but it's it's just a real uh, uh, really soft but thick um, leather it's just great I don't really know how to explain it but uh, this Bible is a life application NIV study Bible and I, I really don't use the NIV very much uh, but my wife gave this Bible to me when we were dating and it was uh it has a ton of sentimental value to me and uh it was really in pretty bad condition it had a a blue bonded leather cover on it when i uh when i got it and that thing is starting to come apart uh over the last 13 years and um and it was just time it was time for a uh overhaul the uh the page edges uh had a silver uh, full and it had uh, silver edges and they were just just in terrible shape terrible shape and uh, I got Francisco to uh, just make the edges blue along with blue art guild so it would uh, it would at least make it look a little more uniform and I love the blue it's unique uh, and the blue and the brown with the uh, with the cream colored ribbons just seems to go well together. And uh, so anyhow, you can see the corners, of course. Uh, he does such a good job. And uh, with the cover, you know, as flexible as it is, it just, it is just nice. It's almost like boot leather. It's just, just so, so comfortable in the hand. And uh, also, uh, I don't think Francisco doesn't do this a whole bunch, but there was a, a severe arch in the at the top from from me sitting the Bible on its on the on its bottom right here, standing it up uh, for years, and, um, and that's just how it would uh, how it would go on the bookshelf. So it developed a bad uh, bad arch at the top of the book, and uh, and really. Uh, I wasn't sure, he wasn't sure if he'd be able to get it all out or uh, at least fix it, but I think he did a really good job. It's still got a slight curvature, but you'd almost have to uh, re-sew it and uh, all that good stuff to get it. See, I didn't, I didn't, uh, he didn't, I didn't really want him to have to get into all that, but uh, anyhow, uh, if we get into it, the Life Application uh, Study Bible is a... Uh, it's a it's a good Bible, you know. I don't I don't use the notes as much now, since I've uh, you know kind of it's a little more um, liberal than than what I usually study with. But it's still a good Bible. It'll it'll state the Reform notes as well as the Ar Armenian notes, um, which it's not it's not it's not bad. It's a good Bible, but uh, and really I don't I didn't restore it. I have it restored so that uh so that I'd use it a ton, but just so that it would be preserved as an heirloom. Um so I'm really looking forward to uh to to using it some and reading from it because I do like to read from the NIV some. So uh and my, my daughters love the NIV, at least um my oldest daughter loves the NIV, at least the way it reads. So, you know, hopefully you know they'll enjoy it one day and use it. But I uh, really ha was happy with how the blue came out. 
And uh, I mean, you can still see tinges of silver where it was left and the dye didn't, doesn't completely cover that silver foil. So it has a little bit of unevenness, but uh, Francisco messaged me and told me about it. I mean, y'all's well aware of it and I'm still very happy with it. Um, again, this being a study Bible, I was, I was glad to get uh, four, four of these ribbons you know, to give plenty of places to study. And I think it just looks, they look nice. The bigger the Bible, you know, the more ribbons probably they'll be used more. So anyhow, anyway, I'm not going to do a big uh, in-depth review of the actual life application study Bible, although it's a, it's a decent Bible, uh, but it has everything that a study Bible should. Uh, the maps are not colored. Um, but then again, it's, it's 13 years old. So uh, that really hasn't come along until just recently, but, uh, you know, it's, uh, it has some good, some good notes and some good, uh, articles. And, um, you know, you'll have your, a large concordance. And, uh, again, there's, there were tons of pages that were just super wrinkled and it, and Francisco straightened them out for me as as best he could and, and it's really not going to be perfect ever again i'm sure but anyway the i love the bible um i'll use the bible you know to study from uh, a little bit when i need a reference of a verse of a phrase by phrase translation this is the one i go to uh, it has good maps but then again uh, i don't really use the maps a ton um i probably should but i don't also, uh, I got Francisco to put Guerrero binding in it again so that, you know, I, I'm, like I said, uh, I think on the, uh, on the legacy review, I'm, I'm proud of, I'm proud of this Bible and I know he is and the work he does. So I really would like to, you know, to have his name in it, uh, being that he did the work for it. So, uh, again, the, the cover is just so nice and, um. Uh, I'm going to hold it up so that you can kind of get an idea of the flexibility. And it, and it lays, it's never laid this flat, of course, being in a bonded cover. So it's just like such a great treat for it to lay so flat and be so, uh, such a nice feel to the hand. Uh, but anyway, that's, uh, that's really it. The, uh, he did the repair to the, uh, to the spine. And uh, he, he did the rib spine. Again, I did it clean, uh, blank spine, just to have that older world look. And uh, it's a it's a semi-yap, but the Bible's so thick. On any other Bible, it would be a full yap. Uh, and actually, it's close to, they're close to touching. Uh, but it's such a nice, nice rebind. Again, uh, Guerrero leather rebinds. I would uh, recommend him. Uh, he's such a professional. And he, and he just is a really good guy. I've uh, really enjoyed uh, working with him on the Bibles uh, I've had work on. Uh, anyway, I'm going to post a link to his Facebook page and uh, look him up. And, uh, and uh, you know, get some his prices are very, very good. Um, so, uh, anyway, hope you enjoyed the review. Uh, I'm sure I left things out. If you have any questions, uh, comment. And uh, if I can do anything better or uh, anything I left out, uh, let me know. And uh, God bless. Take care.